Let's roll. What's up guys? This is Fierce Rex YouTube channel. Thanks for clicking on this video. Today, in this video, I'll be showing you guys how to optimize your PC RAM for gaming. Which will surely boost your in-game FPS and provide you a smooth gaming experience without any kind of stutters. I'll show you step-by-step -step guide to optimize your PC's RAM. Keep in mind that the timestamps are given below, so you can freely navigate around the video without any worries. So let's get started. The very first thing to do, before doing any kind of changes to your windows, is making a restore point. By this restore point, you can restore the system and your data to the way it was before the changes were made. So if anything goes wrong with your system after optimizing it, you won't have to worry, cause you can revert the changes you made to your system. And to make a restore point, search for restore point in the search bar. And then open it up. Select your system drive. And press on configure. Increase it to 2%. And check this option. Now hit apply. Click on OK. Create. Give it a name. Again hit create. Close it. So you're done, creating a restore point for your system. Best performance settings. This is one of the biggest frame changer windows setting. Basically what we're gonna do, is just turn off all the unnecessary fancy animations, of your windows. And to do that, open your PC. Go to the properties. Click on advanced system settings. Click on settings. Adjust for best performance. Check these. And apply. Okay, so you're done changing the settings. You can see the before and after comparison. All the animations are off, and your PC is feeling much lighter. Increase memory. Generally, the faster the RAM, the faster the processing speed. With faster RAM, you increase the speed at which memory transfers information to other components. Meaning, your fast processor now has an equally fast way of talking to the other components, making your computer much more efficient. Increasing the actual RAM of your system is not possible, but allocating something like that is. So, basically we're gonna allocate some virtual memory for your system. So that if it runs out of actual memory RAM, it can use virtual memory instead. So, this will work as RAM but with a slow speed. Still, something is better than nothing, so why not do this? So to increase it, just follow my steps. Go to your PC properties. Select Advanced System Settings. Settings. Advanced. Change. Usually, this option might be checked on your device, and you won't be able to make any changes until you uncheck this, so keep this box unchecked. Now select a drive where most of your games are installed. Select Custom Size. And put the half value of your RAM. In my case, I have 8GB RAM. And half of it is 4GB RAM. 
which means 4096 megabytes RAM. If you think it's complicated, just pause the video and see the number you need. Set and click OK. It will ask you for a restart, so just do it. After the restart, download this software, MEM Reduct, from the link in the description. After downloading, open it up. Click Yes. Proceed through the installation. After installing it, click on Clean Memory. It will just clean up some junks from your system memory. You can use this software whenever you feel your system is lagging. It really lightens up your system. settings. Usually, when we boot our PC, many unnecessary programs open up automatically, which definitely eats up some memory and stays open all the time without any reason. Your Windows may feel sluggish as that you've got too many programs running in the background, programs that you rarely or never use. So now, we're gonna stop those programs to open up when we boot up our PC. And by doing this you will even see a great change in your PC's boot time. And to do this, open your task manager. Go to the startup. And disable all the unnecessary programs from here. Keep in mind that, all the programs are not junk. Some programs may need to start up for your PC. So just don't blindly disable all the programs. Now search for system configuration and open it up. Go to the boot option. Check no GUI boot. Change time out to 10 seconds. Click on advanced options. You might have 2, 8, or 16. So whatever number you have, select the maximum number. Now click OK. Click on apply. It will ask for a restart. Just do it. Ultimate Power Plan. It is one of the most reliable FPS boosting settings, which you all should use. Usually, your PC stays in the balanced power plan, which prevents your PC to use full power when doing heavy graphics work, like playing games or video rendering. So, by enabling this setting, we will be giving our PC full access to its maximum power. And to do that, press on Windows plus R key at the same time. CMD. Copy the code from the video description. And paste it here. Now hit enter. Now exit this. And again press on Windows plus R key at the same time, then type control panel. And hit enter. Go to system and security. Power options. Your power plans might be hided. In that case, just press on the drop down button. Now choose ultimate performance. Close it. So guys you're done changing your PC's power plan. So guys. Thank you so much for sticking with the video so far. Hope this video helped you a lot. Make sure to leave a like, as the YouTube algorithm really likes this process and promotes this video to others. Share this video with your friends, to help them out too.
and subscribe to the channel, as this channel really needs your support to grow more. And if you have any questions or suggestions in your mind, just leave them in the comments section, I'll surely answer them for you. Okay so, stay awesome, be good to your parents, and respectful to your country, see you in the next video, till then.